Okay, we're back at Gino's Transaxle Performance, and today, to all my YouTube friends out there, I'm going to show you how you put a ring gear on the carrier. Anyhow, uh, I hope you can see this. I use a pair of welding gloves, and the ring gear is over there on the hot plate getting hot. And I also have a little screw that goes in the bolt on the bottom to guide it on the carrier here. So let me see if I'm lined up here right or not. Uh, I think that'll cover most of it. Well, anyhow, what we do is grab it like this off of there this in, guide plate, like so, put our glove on, toss it up, and it falls right on the place. And if it doesn't, you use a brass hammer, and you hit it flat, and put it down. Yes, it doesn't hurt to do that with a brass hammer. Now, some people will probably laugh and say, oh, that's terrible. Well, it's not terrible. That's how you do it. That's how I was taught years ago by a guy that knows what he's doing from the VW school. So, now, we take all the bolts out. Here, and lay them down. My back's to you, I'm sorry about that. And lay them here. And yes, there's, we let it cool down for a while. And uh, I put Loctite on these, and then we'll torque it down. We'll be back for more later. And Gino's air cool. And if you want the torch specs, I'm not going to tell you. You're going to have to look them up. They're in the book. Gino's Transaxle Performance.